Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to River Valley Restorations. Today, we've got a couple things on our plate. So, the uh, the company that I sent that disc up off to, uh, it had been, you know, a week or more, you know, a couple weeks ago now at this point. They called me up and they said that they were, you know, they were trying to work on that and uh, they just, they, were, they weren't having much luck. Uh, so I told them, okay, well, we'll just, you know, fix the hydraulics, make sure that it at least works. Don't worry about cosmetics. I can take care of that later on if I want to. Um, and to apologize for that, they actually gave me a tip. They told me that some some guy passed away and his family have taken over the farm. And there's this old shed back out in the field. And um, they're, they're trying to clean it all up. He's, he was like a hoarder. It's like filthy and it's a mess everywhere. So we're going to go out there and we're going to take a look at that today first we are going to go and pick up that disc that i told them to work on because they said that it was ready to be picked up so we get the truck fired up open up the gate we're going to head up into town as always if you guys enjoy the video make sure you hit that like button it helps out a ton for the video and the channel also if you find yourself watching more than one video then go ahead and click that subscribe button because it's a good sign that you enjoy the content and you want to see more of it and be notified when we post new videos all right Let's hit the road, head on up to town, and get that disc, and then we gotta go and take a look at that barn find. Alright, we're pulling up here. Looks like they got it parked exactly where we left it off. I guess they decided to put it back there. I don't know, they got it grown up in the weeds or something, man. What the... Let's check this thing out, though. Okay, so, just taking a look at it. Yeah, they didn't do any cosmetics. They said that they weren't going to, but they did fix up some bearings that were having some issues. They made sure everything was greased. Um, there were a couple of these discs that I think they said that they replaced or sharpened or something. I don't know. But most importantly, they worked on the hydraulic cylinders. I guess it was leaking at the cylinders. So they worked on those. Got the hydraulics all working. And uh, so it's operational now, at least. It doesn't look the most pretty, but it's a disc. It doesn't have to. It's at least operational now. We're going to pull the truck around. Man, the Dirty Dodge is proving its name today. Could use a wash, couldn't it? We're going to back up and hook up to this thing real quick. All right, there we go. We're all hooked up, ready to roll. Let's turn on them flashers, even though this thing has no lights on the back end of it. Turn them on for safety, otherwise we're going to get pulled over for not having them on or something. We're going to slowly roll down to the dealership, drop this thing back off at the dealership. And we're going to hook up to the trailer. And we're going to go and look at this... Uh, this barn. I don't know what's in it. Uh, they said they had no idea what was in it. They just know that uh, someone kicked the can and now his family is, is trying to get rid of all the junk inside. So we're going to go take a look at it because one man's junk could be another man's treasure. You never know. All right. We're rolling up to the dealership. River Valley Restorations finally been chugging along at 20 mile an hour this whole time. Where do I want to put this rusty wreck? Rec of a thing. I'm thinking about just putting it in the back because it's not really the most pleasing thing to look at. But I suppose we can put it out front here. We'll put it over here on this side just because it's not really one of the key things we want people to be looking at. <laughs> it's not very pretty. Of course, neither is that massive wheel loader I got sitting over there. But you know what? I like that wheel loader. I've said it before. I say it every time. I freaking love that wheel loader. Probably one of my favorite things we have here. Anyways, drop that off right there. That ought to do just fine. Going to pull around. Let's turn off some flashers. We're going to pull around into here, hook up to our 40-foot PJ trailer. Oh, we could take the semi. Did we take the truck or did we take the semi? Oh, man, the dilemma. I don't know what they're going to have. You know what? Since they said it's kind of way back and a weird way to get there and we're gonna take the truck and if we need something bigger then we'll come back and we'll get the semi but i think we'll take the truck for now that's probably just gonna work best for us all right we're all hooked up let's roll on out of here man the dirty dodge is no longer the dirty dodge it's now the filthy dodge look at this thing <laughs> all right let's run over to uh where this guy said the barn was and We'll see what they got in store for us here. Maybe we'll get a good find. Maybe we'll find nothing but trash. 
Never know. All right, rolling up to where the field was. He said it was this entrance right here. Man, and he said it was way back in the back of the field. How am I even supposed to get in here, let alone... Um, all this crop is harvested, so it's not going to be a big deal if we pull out into it a little bit here. Oh, we got stuck. We got stuck. Four-wheel drive. Four-wheel drive it. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Wow. No, no, no. Oh, man. We need a, we need a truck that can handle it, man. What I did was turn that too sharp and we bottomed out. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You're almost out. You're almost out. You're almost out. Seriously? Oh. Well. We jackknifed it. I guess that's some sort of progress. Oh. Oh. Okay, okay. Now can I back this up so it's not bottoming out anymore? There we go. There we go. All right. Now what if I... We're going to just go floor it this way. Get the trailer into the field. There we go. Perfect. We're going to just leave her in four-wheel drive from now on. Good. We're still spinning. It's muddy out here. Holy cow. Did, I didn't, did it rain recently? Man, it must be really muddy. Look at this. We got four-wheel drive on and all four tires are just spinning through the mud. Look at it all caking up on the tires even. Holy cow. Oh, that's the turn. Okay, so now we need to go this way. Trailer's following fine. We said it was back here. I don't want to go too fast. We're kind of... We have our div lock on. Oh, we're sliding. This mud's a little slip. A little slippery out here. Yeah, we're going to make that turn. Yep. Perfect. And he said, just got to follow this path all the way back. Where are we going right now? Woo, we're sliding. It is so muddy. I'm afraid to stop. Oh my gosh, we're pushing into the grass. Come on, keep the momentum up though. It's fine. Keep it up. There you go. Oh, oh, I see the barn. This is the barn right here then. Wow. He wasn't kidding when he said it was old and run down, was he? Holy cow. Okay, let's pull the truck up right here. That should be fine. Oh, well, we're going to get stuck. Can I pull this truck somewhere where I'm not going to get stuck? Uh, well, it should be fine. I think we'll be able to get it out of here. Dang. This place is way out in the middle of nowhere, dude. Got a wind uh, windmill. Bunch of trash everywhere. So much trash. Barrels of something. Just trash and trash and trash. Oh my gosh. Wood? Pallets of sand? Sandbags? This They weren't kidding when they said this guy was just a hoarder. Oh, and all this is outside. Was it like inside? Oh no. Oh, I don't know if I want to open this thing up. Okay, let's do it. Let's go. This side looks like it's a little cleaner. Maybe it's been used more. I'm going to try opening this door. Can we get it? Oh, can we peek in there? Oh, I see yellow. Oh, I see green. Oh, is that a... Oh, that's, that's, that's got to be a deer. Is there anything I can see over here? No? Hold on. Let, let's peek through this one. Got to get through the trash. There we go. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, trash is in the way. Oh, wait, wait. I see the cab of a tractor. You'll see that? God, I can't. You see, oh, there it is. Cab of a tractor. What is it, though? All right. Walk through the trash again. I hope I don't get some disease. All right, let's try to open this thing up. Uh, uh. Ooh. Okay. John Deere Diesel 80. Power steering. Whoa, this thing is old. But it's in, like, great condition. Awesome. Be careful. Oh, it's got the electric start on it. This thing is old. Dude, this is so cool. This thing is like in mint condition. Does it start? All right, let's see if it starts. How do you do it here? Electric start, so it should just have this push button. It's been modified. 
Oh, it started right up. No problem at all. Amazing. Okay, let's pull it out. Oh yeah, nice. Let's get this thing in the sunlight. Look at it. Dude, it runs and it's like in mint condition. This is, this is unreal. Look at this. This thing is so cool. Look at that thing. Look at it. Look. It's like all the moving parts. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't know old tractors enough to even tell you how this thing operates. It is so cool though. Okay. That's awesome. Let's shut it off. Let it sit there. Let's see. What, what else is in here? Just a bunch of trash? Is that it? Trash. Trash. Oh, there's the, the tractors and Alice Chalmers. What is it though? Like what? What model? What model are you? It's got a front loader on it. These tires are in great condition. Holy cow. Oh, 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 oh. One. One. What's that say? 180? It's a 180. Ellis Chalmers 180 cab with a front loader. Okay. Let's open it up. All right. All right. Old interior. Not in bad shape, though. Does it start? Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. Dude. This is pretty cool. How the heck... Oh, the hydraulics still work, even. How do we get it out of here? Can we... Can we... We should be able to back it right up out of here, right? We should be able to just go... Straight back. Are we gonna hit anything? Oh, we gotta angle that way a little bit. Otherwise, we're going to hit that. There you go. Anything in the front? Nope. We're skating by. Cool. And now we should be able to back straight up out of here. This is awesome. Two really cool old tractors. Oh, oh, don't hit that. We got to turn this thing around. Okay. Nice and easy. Put her in the corner. Put her in reverse. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go, there you go, there you go. Get out of here now. I'm trying to ride this clutch. And you just let her roll. Nice. Oh, we're going to end up in the brush. We're not careful. Oh, we almost backed into the deer. Look at this thing, though. All this Chalmers, 180 front loader. And a John Deere 80 power steering with, you know, the old diesel. Like, uh, these were originally, like, these were the crank starts. Yeah. Yeah, these were crank starts, but this one's been modified to have, a, like, a pushed start on it. Which means it's been... I mean, it's obviously been renovated since, so I would expect that. I don't even know how the oil is in these things. Oh, they've probably been sitting out here for a while. We probably shouldn't let them run very often. I'm going to take it, though. I'm going to buy them. I'm going to buy them. I already told the guy if I find anything, I'm going to buy them. Don't care what the price is, whatever price he tells me. So let me or let me shut this off because I don't know if the oil is bad in these or, or something. I don't want it running more than it needs to. Let me, uh, let me get his number out of my wallet here and give him a call. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 There was, yeah. The deer. Uh-huh. And the Ellis Chalmers. Yeah. The 180. You want how much for the deer? 3500 Okay. What do you want for the Alice Chalmers? Eight? You want 8000 for the Alice Chalmers? Um, no. I, I mean, yeah, but it's probably retail. What if I, because, you know, I got to resell here. What if I give you, I'll give you 3500 on the deer, and then I'll give you, um, Let's make it 9K overall. I'll give you 9,000 overall. Okay, I can do 10. We'll do 10. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I'll wire you the money, John. Yep. All right, John. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Hey, if you want to come look at these things and see them at our VR, just let me know. All right. Yep. Bye. All right, guys. We did it. We bought it. 10k for the set. You wanted 3,500 for this, 8 for that. Which one do we load up first? I think we should probably do the deer first, right? That deer probably... 
I don't know which one weighs more, dude. This one looks like it would, but that thing's old and all straight steel, so it might. Um. Yeah, let's load the deer up first. Let's let's just do that. Let's pull this one out of the way. Back it. Up. Nope, nope. Back it up. There you go. We're just gonna put it right back into here for the time being. He said he's coming out here in the next couple days to clean up all the trash, or at least try to. I'm like, ooh, good luck, buddy, because there's quite a bit of it. Okay. Let's fire up the deer. Oh. Come on. Come on. Seriously? The push button start isn't cranking it over. We just had this thing running. What is the deal? Did it, it didn't seize up or something, did it? <sighs> okay. I just bought it and then it stops working. Are you kidding me? Now what? Um, I guess I need to have a mechanic look at it. I don't want to have someone come out here. Uh, Ooh, oh, we have the winch. Do I have a tow hook with me? Oh, <gasps> no, I don't. I didn't bring the tow hook. Ah. Oh. You've got to be kidding me. I didn't bring the tow hook. Seriously, I brought the winch and didn't bring a tow hook. God dang it. What do we do? Do we go back and get it? Do we... Okay. I guess the deer... It's going to have to sit there for now. Let's at least get this loaded up. Man. I don't know what to do. I guess I could come back out with a tow hook and tow it out of here. I could just come here and, and have a guy work on it, though, and just get it running out here. I don't... Oh, what if it rains? It's sitting out and it's outside and it has no cab? You've got to be kidding me. Of course that's the one that broke down. Couldn't have been the Alice Chalmers, which probably would have handled it a little better. Oh, well. Not much we can do about it. Shut that down. Strap it up. There we go. Well, I'm sad to see we don't have two tractors that we bought on the trailer, but we got one. Let those get all folded up, and we're going to get out of here. I'm going to have to make some phone calls. Oh, don't you get stuck, too. Oh, my God. No. I need a new truck, man. I need a new truck, or I need to stop driving way out here into the boonies and getting stuck in the field. We are not doing this again. Come on, guys. We have no traction. <laughs> It's muddy. It's, it's pure mud out here, and we got a loaded down trailer. <sighs> okay. Okay, real quick. We undo these ratchets. Let's unload the trailer. Let's see if we can just at least get it out of here and get it over into more solid ground or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We're going to try and get out of here. All right, we got that unloaded. Now we're solely the trailer, but we might have dug ourselves down into a... Oh, no, 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 there we go. There we go, there we go. We're still spinning, but we're able to get out. Keep on going, come on. Keep that momentum. There you go. It was just too much weight. Man, that tractor could not... It, there's no way it weighs that much, right? No way. I mean, that tires are filthy. Okay. I'm going to pull up here onto the grass a little bit in hopes that I'll give me more traction than the mud. There we go. Let's get that loaded back up. Okay. Come on. Four-wheel drive. You can do it. Go. Go, 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 go. No! That's not that much weight! Come on! We got it. We're rolling. Finally. We are able... Jeez, this is a rough road, man. This is a... This is going to be a pain. I think... No, I definitely don't want to... No, the semi doesn't have four-wheel drive. We are not bringing the semi out here. For a second, I was like, yeah, that's a better idea, right? Wrong. So wrong. So we're going to have to have somebody take a look at that deer, or we're going to have to come back with the tow hook. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But... That's going to do it for this video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up. If you find yourself watching more than one video, hit that subscribe button because it's a good sign that you enjoy the content and you want to see more. Until next time, I'll see you all later.